knock, knock. Hey, hey, Jambu. Thank God you're at home. Hey. How many times would I warn you about coming to my home? Don't let my wife meet you here. You better go now. Jambu, bring your voice down. What is wrong in a, in a man going to do for his friend? By the way, I have come to tell you that I am very sorry for what happened to other day. Seriously, I didn't mean to. Don't you know that what you did to those girls can send you to jail? Even you deserve punishment. Jumbo, you have started again. No? Oh, so you want to tell me that I no longer have right to my privacy? But those girls are your sister's in-laws. What about if they are your biological children? Is that what you will do to them? It's improper. I think this conversation is over. I have important things to do. It can never be over. Because I've told you several times. It's now you realize your mistake. After putting those girls to danger in the street. No, but they have a family. I am tired of accommodating strangers. But they are your wife's relations. By the way, what is your wife's opinion on this matter? Um, my wife traveled. But before she traveled, uh, I already told her my stand and she understand. That's not a bad idea. But I will advise you that we should go and look for those girls. That's the best way. Oh, I should go and look, look for those girls? Yes. Uh, I should carry my cross. Is that what you mean? I should go and look for them. I'll credit you. Thank you very much. Jethro, please, if you don't want to listen to me next time, don't ever come here to look for those girls again. You come here to throw tell me rubbish. And please, make sure you take good care of Mama. Is that clear? You said I'm going back to take care of my own husband. Eh? Please. And don't hesitate to call if there is anything you want us to talk about. Okay, sister. Thank you, my love.
Yes, I live here all alone. Who has this um, place lived in Kenya? It belongs to my only daughter. You have a daughter? Where is she? She's dead. I lost her and her mother in a ghastly motor accident. I'm so sorry about that. It's okay. It's not your fault. It's not anybody's fault after all. But I miss my family. The day I lost my family was the day I lost everything. The day I lost my mother was the day I lost everything. May the Lord raise their souls. I will never stop blaming my father for everything. Never. It's okay. <laughs> it's not been easy. <laughs> <laughs> 